All right, guys, we got this. Let's go. Good white trip speed. Control Zex, go. On one, on one. Ready? Go. Right. What's up, guys? It's Pick'em with Huddle GG, and in today's video, we're going to show you how to completely shut down the QB rap play out of the Baltimore Ravens playbook. Now, for those of you that don't know, the Baltimore Ravens playbook under the spread double flex formation has this play QB wrap. Okay, they are the only playbook in the game that has it. And if you have played a good amount of Madden, you probably have seen this a time or two. And it is frustrating. It is a good play, um, but it's easy to stop if we know what we're doing here. Okay, so this is what the play art looks like from an offensive point of view. And you see that the left tackle is pulling. Again, it looks like a read option with the play but this is a quarterback designed run with that polling tackle to give us extra blockers. Okay, so let's run it here against a couple of random defenses and just see that it can get open really well, right? And you can get some big yards with this. Okay, so we'll go to replay and look at that first one real quick uh, and just see again, we say, hi, we have that polling tackle. He fills that gap, blocks that second level defender and we have a big hole to run through, right? This is an easy 20 yard gain. Uh, with that rep again let's run it one more time here you're gonna see that if you know what you're doing you can pick the right holes you're going to get a good chunk on a lot of these plays if the defense doesn't know what they're doing okay so how are we gonna stop this and the way that we're gonna stop it is very easy and we can do it out of a couple of formations first we're gonna go over dollar okay um, you can use dollar and then we'll go over big nickel over G as well so we'll show a three down line and then a four down line all right, so we're going to come out in dollar. doesn't matter the play, right? So that's what's good about this counter is, is the play that you're running on defense is kind of irrelevant. All we need to do is focus on that left tackle, right? We know that that left tackle is pulling, right? He's going to pull and fill the backs or the gap to the right side of the screen. So we're going to use that to our advantage, right? We are going to user this linebacker to the left. Okay, so you want to be opposite of the running back. And you want to kind of hide above the defensive end of your side, okay? So what's going to happen here is 79, the left tackle, is going to pull to the right. We already know that, right? So what does that leave? That leaves one blocker, 72, to pick up us and the defensive end on this side, right? So he doesn't have anyone else to block. So he's going to block the defensive end, which then will allow us a free run down this gap to the quarterback and we're gonna hit him in the backfield every single time. Okay, so let's run this. Uh, again, we're just in cover four right now on defense, but again, the defensive play does not matter. Right, we see that guy pull, we come down and we make the tackle in the backfield for negative four, negative five yards, and I'm telling you this is every single time. Okay, it is not random. It is going to be consistent for you every time. Again, as soon as we see that left tackle pull, we shoot down in the gap, we hit the quarterback in the backfield and we get a big loss, okay? now. The good thing with this is once we see that left tackle pull, we can automatically know that it's QB wrap because there's no other play in the Baltimore Ravens playbook that has the left tackle pulling. Okay. So again, as soon as you see him pull, you shoot down. Just make sure you avoid the running back. Um, if you run into the running back, he can sometimes trip you up. But you can see that we ran it three times in a row and we had no issues getting the quarterback either time. Right. So. Again, we see, we see that left tackle pull. At that point, we know, hey, we're running downhill. Just make sure you avoid the running back, and then you can hit the quarterback in the backfield. All right? So again, we can run this out of other formations as well, uh, Big Nickel being one of them. And we're going to do it very similarly uh, as we just did the dollar. I like dollar the best, to be completely honest, against that. Um, I just think it's the easiest and most open gap to shoot. But here, if we are in Big Nickel, we do want to, again, get to this back side right over this defensive end as soon as we see him shoot down we come down with our linebacker through the hole and we make a tackle in the backfield so again as soon as you see that left tackle pull we know that hey it's qb wrap we're running straight through that gap avoid the running back and you're going to be able to hit the quarterback in the backfield every single time for a negative gain on the play if you've made it to the end of this video odds are you're serious about becoming a better madden player and we're here to help on our website at huddle.gg, $9.95 a month unlocks all of our full game plans created by some of the best Madden players in the world. You'll also have access to our private Discord where Madden Pros will answer your questions and help take your game to the next level. Have a great day.